right, everybody, before you see my toenails, I got a spray tan. And so it's still on my toenails. So it looks like I have fungus. We should do like a little post that says, is this fungus or not? Anyway, I'm gonna show you how to trim your toenails. So the first thing you wanna do is make sure you just get a little nip, especially if you're using big old nip, uh, nail nippers like this. Just follow that line. Don't overthink it. If you've got a curette at home, then definitely after you trim it, get in these edges. A lot of people think that they're gonna create ingrown toenails by um, uh, getting into the corner. You're gonna be fine. Just don't go nutty and get really deep in there. But I always follow that white line. Okay, just a little bit at a time. Right there. Oh my God, they're so yellow. So note to self, if you're getting a spray tan, highly recommend getting some clear nail polish on there before you do so. <laughs> so pretty basic guys. I would love to know what questions you have about trimming your nails because honestly it is one of the most common questions i get asked it just goes slow a little bit at a time my golden rule is just to leave a little bit of the white stuff that way you're not getting it too short you obviously don't want to get into the quick of things um so you want to keep them just enough She's got regular nippers, people. This is really hard with these. These are massive. You know, we use these to trim on patients all the time, but this is not easy to do on myself. Okay. Oh, that one flew across our office. Okay, so then what I'm gonna do when I'm done is just get a cure right onto the, the left foot with all the yellow toenails. follow the natural shape of your toenail whatever it is and there's so many different so many different shapes of nails all right time to clean everything out now so this is a I think it's technically an ingrown toenail remover but it's got a like nice little rasp on the end of it so you can get in those edges I guess to dig out that crud if there's any in there. Normal healthy nails, you really don't need that Dremel. Something like this is just fine. This is gonna be including in our new instrument uh, option with Mod Pod. So just kind of gently do it, nothing crazy. What I'm gonna do now for the discoloration um, is go ahead and start using the repair product on my toenails because number one, I wanna lighten up the color. Uh, number two, I want to ensure no fungal growth in the on the nail itself. I think I'm pretty much in the clear, but it's gonna help strengthen it as well. And as overall, give it a better look. This is something that you can also order off of um, our Shopify account. So, boom, it's, this is it right here again. It's called Repair, and it's got, um, like I said, the oils in it, great antifungal, and even urea in it to help uh, thin out if you have thicker nails. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed my tutorial and making fun of my yellow suntan toenails. Uh, until next time, thanks for watching.